Hey everybody, Johnny Be Good here, located in Girard, Ohio, at the uh, Petro. Just woke up. I thought I'd show you this massive, massive windmill blade. From a far distance, this thing looks smaller than the actual blade size. But uh, look how big this thing is. And I think it's hollow. But it's pretty thick. Pretty thick in there. Just to give you guys a reference of how big this thing is. Yep. From a far, far distance, these things are not that big. But I bet you these things is about 150 feet or more a piece. Making it about a hundred, about three hundred, about three hundred uh, feet diameter, and uh, that's what the inside looks like. And I think these are bolts. Look how big those things are. They supposedly can withstand, uh, what is it, a class four or hurricane. So yeah, they're, they're massive. Pretty darn big, huh? Also, this is a rare occasion where there's actually like a fifth wheel on the back. You see here, this will flip it. This will flip it, um, causing it to turn. Other than the truck will turn in the front, I think this will turn too. They actually will drive this on the back they can steer it in the back because none of the streets are big enough or long enough to one one eight Miller Road Washington Illinois GE purchase So anyway, I thought it was interesting for me to showcase this to you guys. There are, uh, I think there are six of these here. If it's six, then there's two windmills. I definitely need to shower here. I still got about one hour to finish my 10 hour break. I can't really go anywhere yet, so. And as I mentioned last night, I was hoping to run into some rain that way to get the soap out of my truck. I never did, so the truck's still dirty. It's still a little bit soapy. And it don't look like it's gonna rain today. All right, well that's it. We'll catch you guys later. Peace.